Something weird has been happening to me lately. I can't explain it. It's just this feeling of guilt that haunts me. I don't know where it's coming from or what it's supposed to mean. The closest clue I have is this boy I see every day on my way to school. He just stands there on the side of the road waiting for someone to pick him up, I guess. But I feel like he just watches me, like he's waiting for me to go by to see if maybe I finally notice him. I don't know what came over me today. I decided to stop and pick up a complete stranger. It was like an instinct, like my subconscious was trying to tell me something I couldn't understand. So I promised myself I would try. And he got into my car and I thought I would be afraid, but I wasn't. I asked where he was going and he told me he worked up the street in the field somewhere. He was never really specific with his answers, so I went with it and started to drive. He started to ask me about myself, about school, work, my friends. Before I could ask him anything, he said it was time to drop him off, and so I did. But there was something interesting about him, something I couldn't just let go. So before he closed the door, I made sure to let him know I would pick him up again tomorrow in the same spot. There's something about him that is so familiar, but I can't figure it out. I feel like he's someone important who's just being left on the side of the road like nothing and no one. I don't know what it is about him. I just want him to feel like he matters, like someone cares about him. I can't take my mind off him. It's like he belongs in some part of my life, but I can't figure out where he fits in. The next couple of days I got to know him better. He was really vague about most things, like what exactly he did as a job and why his parents weren't around to help him get to work. But I liked talking to him. It was comforting in a way, but at the same time, there was something about him I couldn't figure out. And that's why I picked him up every day. I had this gut feeling that he needed to be sitting next to me, like it needed to happen for my own sake. Everything changed on this day. I passed his usual drop-off spot in order to go fill up with gas. He got mad, really mad, as though breaking our routine broke something else. And when we got to the gas station, I asked him for money since I had been driving him every day. He told me he had no money and that I was the one who owed him. I couldn't understand and he wouldn't explain. All he could say was my secret wouldn't be kept hidden forever. I have a secret. Something I refuse to admit. Something that's been haunting me since the incident. He was a boy. He was my age. But I was reckless, and I left him there. And I just can't take it anymore. So now it's my turn. It's my turn to leave it all behind. And this... This is the only way I know how. A Florida woman kills herself after years of agony. Hi everyone, it's David Begno and this is Newsbreaker. Throw me in the landfill Don't think about the consequences Throw me in the dirt pit Don't think about the choices that you make Throw me in the water Don't think about the splash I will create Leave me at the altar Knowing all the things you just escaped She helped your father cut away, leave me on the track.